don't know. Whatever. Hopefully it'll stay. As I look busted. Great. You decide to vlog your life like this. So I have my iPad, iPad, iPad mounted. Like this shit is a fiasco. But we'll see. Anywho, <clears throat> so I, I must speak on this whole like um, fucking fiasco I'm going through with my apartment complex. So I pay my rent. Our rent is due on the third, by the third of every month, and so like I paid it on time. It was like not an issue. And then on the set, the third was on a Sunday. This all these facts are paramount. So the third was on a Sunday. So the lady called me and she was like, "Um, yeah." She called me on the seventh, which was a Friday. She said, "Um, yeah. We need to talk about your November rent payment." I'm like. You know, what is there to discuss? I paid it on the third. She's like, oh yeah, someone busted in and stole all the money orders out. So, what we need you to do is blah, blah, blah. I kind of blacked the fuck out because I was like, are you kidding me right now? Like, dude. And you know what's so funny is that when I was paying, I just had like this funny feeling. But, you know, I mean, it's the third on a four o'clock. It's 4 o'clock on the 3rd. Like, what are you going to do? So, you know, with that being said, I'm like, she's like, well, if you can just find your receipt. And so, she was telling me I had to find my receipt. And I have to, like, file a police report and file a claim. And I'm like, lady, you honestly didn't tell me this until, like, five days later. And she was like, well, if you get your, if the... If you can get it reimbursed, we won't charge you any late. We're not going to charge you any late fees. Well, you ain't going to be charging me shit. Because I've already paid, ma'am. Like, are you kidding me right now? So, I had to wait. I always check. And make sure. I'm like notorious for leaving my phone. But, I, um. So, I'm like, this is whack. Like in real life, wank. Just wank. Um, so I had to wait three days. I filed a police report on Monday. Found her receipts, not that little slip of paper. But you please know she had peace in my mind. So, like, filed a police report for, on Monday. I had to wait till I could get the actual police report from the police station on Thursday to be able to file it with Western Union. And I sent her everything I had. I was like, look, I, here's all of the, all of my documents, you know, please advise on next steps, you know, and I made sure to say, look, it's at this point, <laughs> it's been a gazillion years. I don't think there's any way that this money can be recovered. She was like, well, we just really need you to ask for a reimbursement and blah, blah, blah. And then, you know, I'm like, get, get your life, like for real, get your life. So she said, they put a notice in my door at like 7 o'clock this morning that says, oh, um, we understand that this is so frustrating and blah, 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 blah. And you won't, here's the thing. She said, you won't, we will deduct all of the charges you have incurred from the total amount due. You know what that means? They still, they're A, because they said something about getting it reimbursed. So they're A, holding out for me to get this reimbursement. And then B, if I don't get it reimbursed, then they want me to pay. That's just not going to happen. There is no way that I can pay rent twice in one month and then pay again for December. It's just not going to happen. So I call the corporate office and I'm like, office, office. I call the corporate office and I'm like, you guys need to like advise, advise on next steps. Cause like this shit, we're not on the best of terms. They are unhelpful. Every question I have, they're like, no, no, no. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So like, dude, 
I don't know. I don't know. It's just so irritating. Like, so you're, oh, so irritating. Because it's like, I pay my rent on time. I shouldn't have to go through this. It's like a fiasco. It's annoying. More so than anything. But it's a gorge. Gorgy, gorgy, gorgy day. I'm headed to Target to look at cameras. I was going to go to Starbucks. But I think I'm going to skip Starbucks. And... Um, just go get my vitamins because I need some. All me for whatever money should be the same. Jay's on, pink ring, don't eat, I need quarantine in the same league. We don't all the same. Oh, you want all the fame? I hear this all the time. Since you love me, I said, baby girl, fall in line. Okay, made a million off of dental, dental. Watch me set you up, walk in. Eon alert, Eon alert. You need that work, I got that work. Got you fit my condo. Just bought a shirt that cost a Mercedes Benz condo. From the H to Toronto, we let them know. I realize you don't know anything about me. <laughs> Yeah. First of all, so I live in Atlanta. I'm from Atlanta. Um, last in the Atlanta is a, um, is a melting pot of like just everybody. Um, and I've lived in other places. I've lived in Michigan, Florida, Carolina. Um, I've traveled some, not as much as I like, but you know. Um, I just. I'm coming up on my birthday and I feel like this year was hellacious <laughs> in more ways than one but I, I had said kind of crazily in the beginning of the year like I'm being prepped for something really really big and you know I've struggled a lot um, in every way and I just ultimately want to help people you know what I mean so and you know I don't want people oh, go fast um I just want, I don't want people to feel like they're a mom, you know, and if I can tell my story to help somebody, then for sure. So I finally got my Forever 21 package. Yay! Now I need a knife to open it. I got like two beanies. And um, a pair of shoes. So let's move to more light. I can see. Beanies. This one's really cute. I think it's like four dollars. No, it's six eighty. It's really cute. It just has California Republic. And then it has a really cute like pleather hat. And this was ten eighty. Did that come through? Kind of, but not really. No, oh, my resolution is stupid and I got some little fakey Tims that's what I'm calling them fakies <laughs> fakey Tims I've wanted some ever since I saw that Chloe had some oh my god these are Thick. Oh, they look just like the real joints. I used to have Tim's and I rocked them all the time. I'm trying on. I mean, aside from the okay, puppy Luke decides he wants to do whatever he wants. Luke, okay, these are bananas with like leggings shorts I wear a size 7 these are crazy they're kind of loose but um, 
I only paid like 30 bucks for these, right? I think. I can't see. The white. Yeah, these were like $36. These are crazy, dude. She likey. She likey very much. She likey. You like Puppy Luke? <laughs> He's like, yes. Here's the other one. Here's my baby, Jack, and Luke. <laughs> Luke is the surrogate pup babysitting for the day. But yeah, so these are it. These are bananas right now, dog. Oh, so sick. Bada! All right, of course I have the cowlicks popping but um I'm actually about to go to the Rick Ross concert I think I mentioned that earlier I mentioned that this morning why why are you doing this um so it'll be fun I guess but this is me <sighs> made up she cleans up she cleans up honey yes yes she cleans up so this is me in white. So I haven't put any lipstick or anything on just yet, but it'll be dark in the car and I haven't figured out like how I hadn't figured it out. I mean look, this is day one, okay? Give me a break. Okay. Um so yeah, this is it. I have on a top that I realize is sheer. <laughs> Bra! Um from H and M. I think these pants are from um just fab or something just yeah just fab to find my other shoe here but I'm just gonna put on my flats yeah I'll put on my flats I need a bracelet of some kind anyway I'm in my closet my closet is crazy I don't know. I just feel like making faces. Whenever I put on makeup, I feel like making faces. It's so stupid. Alright, so I think that's it.